Hey everyone and welcome back to Days Gone. On this video, we're taking down the Sagebrush Point Horde. This horde is located in Highway 97, just to the east of us. And it is daytime, so they are almost certainly in their cave. Their cave is right there. Um, before I go over to them though, I would like to try to get some more materials, some more supplies. Especially scrap. Scrap has been really hard to find recently. For whatever reason, I can't open up most of the cars. Which I find extremely annoying. Oh, but this one I can. Perfect. So yeah, I just want to make sure I've got some supplies. Um, the good thing is I do have that giant machine gun now. <laughs> Nothing like scrap. Which at least gives me an option to take down the horde with just bullets. Ooh, nice. Five scrap. That's not bad at all. Over there's a nest, so that's not going to help. Uh, well, I don't need it as far as I know, but I can get some ammo here, and I can also open up that hood. Yeah. Oh, apparently I needed it. Gave me a bunch of machine gun ammo. That's perfect. Nice, another five scrap. And what do we have back here? Kerosene. Do I actually need it? I might be full. I think I'm full. It's not letting me take it. Yeah. Okay. Uh, well, that should help a lot. At least in terms of repairing the bike and making pipe bombs and stuff like that. So, let's go see... If the horde is there. Oh, and this is another horde that tends to bug out a lot for me. So if you engage this horde and there is no health bar, just run away. Because if you kill that horde, you won't get credit and they'll just respawn later. Really sucks, but yeah, don't bother if you don't see that health bar. Alright, are you guys home? Well, I hear them. I don't see them. Let's go with uh, a tractor for this one. They're a big horde. As you can see. I'm kind of tempted to just throw a napalm molotov in there, though. Put that right there. Alright. Napalm molotov. And wait for it. Oh, I can't even see. Screw it. Throw it. Throw it. Oh, that might have just completely missed. Crap, I don't know if I got any of them with that. I did not. That was terrible. I was wasting my Napalm Molotov. Oh, no, I got some. I just saw the bar go down a little bit. Oh, God. Pump it up. Alright, I think I'm just going to take this one down with the machine gun. Especially since I got all this extra ammo for it. Oh, my bike! My poor bike! Oh my god, these bushes! This gun plus the health from headshots perk it's kind of overpowered. It's like impossible to ever die unless you just get chain stunned. But I guess that's kind of the point. The amount of hordes you have to take down to get this gun is kind of absurd. Alright, I think they'll want to throw something else at him. Maybe a pipe bomb? Oh, I don't have any gunpowder. I can't do that. Let's just use a Molotov. Thin them out a little bit. Alright, there should work. There we go, I got like 10 of them at least. Alright, almost through this. Ah, got me. 
I'm gonna finish him off with the old Chicago chopper. Oh, I'm almost out of stamina. Sagebrush Point Horde has been defeated. Diamond Lake Trust goes up. And the Horde Killer storyline has updated. Oh, and I maxed out my trust in Diamond Lake. Awesome. So every camp is max trust. I don't know if max trust with Diamond Lake gets us anything special, but the next time I go there, I'll take a look. Just pick up all these ears. Let's see, how many did I get in here? Oh, like none. Wow, that was a bad throw. Don't waste your napalm molotovs like that. They are kind of difficult to make. They require somewhat rare supplies. Polystyrene and growler. Not good to just throw them away. All right, let's look at that storyline update. Horde killer. Oh boy, it's getting hard to find stuff. There it is. The Sagebrush Point Horde. The reason there are so many hordes down here is because of Highway 97. Like I said, it's still a highway. Works just fine. Only not for cars and trucks. Now it's a highway for freaks. One more down. Alright, and let's do our normal beat up the bike and repair it game. And eventually, I might actually freaking finish. Oh, we might be able to get some supplies over here. Or not. Is there nothing? Nothing. Well, that's lame. I wish I could just beat up my own bike. Just grab a bat or something. That would make a lot more sense than just running into stuff. Well. Oh, crap. I would imagine I'm somewhat close at least. If I'm not at least 50% there, I'm going to be very upset. But I do know that I did not repair my bike much during the game. So I could actually be pretty far away. Anyways, that's good enough for now. Let's go ahead and repair. Let's see what I can do. Good. Okay, four more pieces of scrap in. Does that get us the trophy? It does not. Well, that sucks. Any fuel here? No, just a toolbox. All right, well, we're gonna wrap things up right here. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.